Any entrepreneur knows that there's a chance that their business may not succeed. Risk is natural in any new business venture, of course. The Small Business Administration says that while about 80% of small businesses make it through their very first year, only 50% of small businesses make it past the first five years. Only one in three celebrate their 10th anniversary. Let's look at the signs to be watching for. Hi, I'm David Wiener, Mr. Cashflow, and if this type of video could be helpful to you and your business, please give me a thumbs up on this video and hit that subscribe button to get more videos that will help build your cash flow and your business's bottom line. Also, in the comments section, please let me know what your biggest small business challenge is right now and how long you've been in business. Small business owners don't have a crystal ball, giving them the clarity of knowing what the future holds. And there are some clear warning signs that the company is stumbling and in danger of failing. We'll tackle the most important six in this video. First of all, a failing income statement. Keeping an eye on the income statement is vital, no matter the age of the company. Red flags that you can see include a rising accounts receivable line, meaning customers just aren't paying you as quickly as they should, or not at all. If your accounts receivable is too high and you're failing to collect on it, this could signal real trouble. Fortunately, there's help available if this is the case. Second thing you want to look out for is low cash on hand. Watching the balance sheet unbalance should make any business owner or CFO nervous. If cash on hand is shrinking or if you need to sell assets to make payroll, that's a bad sign. Are sales down? Are your shelves filled with inventory that isn't moving? If your business has a credit line, is it maxed out? Watch out for company bills not being paid quickly or increasing debt as a definite sign of trouble. Third, look at external market factors signaling increased competition. When a company feels growing competitive pressure, they have to have the cash flow in the business to shift their tactics. If cash flow is a problem, a competitor could come in and outbid or undercut you on price, which could drive you right out of business very, very quickly. Fourth, legal troubles. Beware of the corporate lawsuit. For companies struggling to stay afloat, a host of legal issues could arise, such as vendors suing for non-payment of bills, lenders pursuing property or equipment repossession, or even failure to pay quarterly taxes. Proactive compliance is vital in all areas of business, and sufficient cash flow will keep your creditors satisfied. Fifth, failure to make payroll. If payroll checks bounce, there is a huge problem with the health of the company. One missed paycheck could have a long-lasting impact on the employment relationship. Once trust is gone, employee morale can decline in a self-perpetuating loop that customers will definitely begin to notice and notice very quickly. Lastly, bookkeeping holes. The health of a business can almost always be determined by the quality of the financial documentation. Clean books and a clean accounting system, bookkeeping system, can impact the company's decision about future purchasing, future growth. Without an accurate record, how can companies create a strategic plan for expansion? The simple answer is, they can't. While small companies can go through financial hills and valleys, these six signs may signal that the business is in really real trouble. Time is not on your side though. The earlier you can recognize the warning signs of a business who is in trouble, the more likely you are to be able to fix the small problem before it becomes a business ending crisis. Don't try to do it alone. There is help available. Find a mentor find a business coach, or find a mastermind group that can help you clarify both what the issues are and what the solutions could be. I'd be happy to help you find some of these resources that are a good fit for you and for your business. 
For a free consultation with me, contact me at the email, website, and phone listed in the video description. And don't forget to subscribe to my videos. Be smart about your business. And don't be a statistic. Cash flow strategies. After all, it's your money. Keep more of it.